doing something completely different today and I urge everybody to let me know down below what you think if you want to see more of this uh, basically with everything doom and gloom right now with everything going on in current events I thought it'd be kind of cool to break away from that and do something a little more fun uh, a lot of people in the gun slash EDC slash tactical community are fans of morale patches as am I being a self-proclaimed patch whore and I thought it'd be kind of fun to do patch reviews now these are basically not going to be super long they're just going to be Super short, you know, a couple minutes, a couple patches, uh, where I got them, what I think of them, that kind of deal. And maybe maybe in one of these videos you see one that you don't have or you didn't know about, and you end up adding it to your collection. So with that being said, let's get into the very first one. Also, if you have an idea for a name of this, let me know, because I haven't quite figured out a name for this series, but let's get into it. So we're going to start with Movie Madness. Uh, today we've got two patches from two different movies that kind of... Kind of uh, cult following we're going to start with this one which if you've seen pulp fiction you instantly know what this is this is big kahuna burger uh this is their logo and i got this off ebay it is still available i'm not entirely sure if uh it's sourced from, an, from somebody else and put on ebay but when you google it it comes up on ebay first i couldn't find any shop selling it specifically so i think it's just something that someone's selling off ebay uh pretty cool patch uh, it's one of the ones that uh, I had to add to Velcro myself. Adding Velcro is actually not that hard. You can really find some uh, really nice adhesive Velcro like I did and just stick it on the back. And, I mean, it won't stand up to, uh, you know, extreme torture. But if you're just collecting it, it works just fine. Uh, there's a lot of cool things about this. And there's, well, a lot of flaws with it, sadly. Um, so, starting out, I want to say this is probably the best Big Kahuna Burger patch you're going to find. I did an extensive look because I am a fan of Pulp Fiction and wanted to have a patch of the logo. But even with that being said, you can notice the coloring is not all there. Like, the, you know, the burger's red instead of being, well, burger color and different stuff. And the bun's kind of off-colored and the surfer guy is not the right color and all that. Uh, but with that all being said, the second you see this patch, you instantly know what it is. So I kind of give it a little bit of pass because at the end of the day, uh, this wasn't very expensive. I think it was like five or six dollars. So not really, not really gonna beat on it too hard. But you know, if you're looking for a cool big Kahuna burger patch, this might fit the bill, especially being probably the nicest one out there. Um, but again, kind of cool. Next we have, and this one for fans of Dirty Harry will instantly know what this is. This is his badge for from the movie Dirty Harry, seen. Uh, I think you see it twice. I know you see it at the end of the first movie where he chucks it into the water. But this is the Inspector Callahan badge. Inspector 2211 San Francisco PD. This patch is from Alan Anker and as far as I know is still available. And this one is really cool because I don't know how easily you can tell. But the gold in here is actually metallic and it really kind of sparkles. It's kind of nice and it gives it that little extra pop. Uh, the detail on this is really nice. They really went above and beyond and put in um, everything kind of 3D. So the lettering is 3D. And then the, the uh, gold accent is uh, the base with the, the blue lines are 3D as well, with the numbers being 3D. Uh, so really nice patch. Does come with Velcro, so can apply it to your wall or whatever right away. Um, but this is a really nice done patch, and I must say, uh, they really put a lot of effort into making this look like the prop. So that is pretty cool, especially if you're a Dirty Harry fan. But that's pretty much it. So that is two patches reviewed in a couple minutes. Uh, let me know what you think if you uh, have these or are looking for these. And uh, if you want to see more of these. So with that being said, have a good day.